Hello everyone, this is Alvin from Shining 3D. After watching our previous episodes, you already know how to scan object and output mesh data. In this video, I will introduce how to use the automatic turntable to make your scanning easier, especially for small size objects. First of all, we need to power on turntable and connect it to our computer. Then we can go to the scanning interface. There are three alignment modes which support the automatic turntable. Marcus mode, global Marcus mode, and turntable alignment mode. We will try the Marcus mode first. The scanning distance and brightness adjustments are the same as regular scanning. And turn on the with turntable function. We can set turntable steps, which means how many steps to finish one turn or half turn. And set turntable speed. Also, choose one turn or half turn according to your requirements. After everything is well set, click scan button and turntable will start to turn during the scanning until it's finished. Since we are using markers alignment, when pasting markers, have to make sure that between each turn, they share at least four common markers. All alignment will not complete and no data will be captured in that frame. If you find the data is not complete, for example, we do not have data of the bottom side, you can flip and continue to use turntable to scan or close turntable function and set object position manually to scan frame by frame. And the scan data will automatically align to the previous scan data as long as they share at least four common markers. Next is a global Marcus mode. Similar to the Marcus alignment mode, set appropriate turntable parameters and it will automatically capture global markers and then we can switch to point cloud scanning. Each adjacent frame still needs to share more than four common markers. The last one is turntable alignment. Before the actual scanning, it would do a turntable calibration automatically with an object which has enough features on the turntable and within the scanning range. After the calibration is successful, it will start to scan automatically and you can use the calibration data of the turntable next time by enabling the use existed verified data function as long as the relative position between the turntable and the scanner does not change. These are the basic skills of using the automatic turntable to make the scanning more convenient. And thanks for watching.